<laughs> we like to we like to what? We like to welcome you to BeMoreNews.com, the news before the news, where we uncover the truth. Up here at the studios of E Media, Mark Clark. Donnie. We got T Sizzle on the building, number 55. That's not T Sizzle, is it? This is a lovely Wow. Brandy. You can call me T Sizzle if you like. I don't miss you. Eric Stewart, how you doing, partner? I'm doing just fine, just enjoying. Uh, to Brown Suggs coming into the studio here on the Mark Clark TV show. We really appreciate him coming out and promoting his uh, party that is a big fundraiser for sickle cell anemia. Really happy to support him. Okay. You know, one thing, Big Brother, we're so proud that you understand social consciousness. We had a lot of athletes come out of this city that just don't give back. Why do you give back? I don't know, because I know what it's like to be on the other side of the fence. You know I mean? Sometimes just a little help can go a long way, you know what I mean? You never know what a person really just going through and just how much, you know, you can just help they day just by, you know, extending some kindness, you know what I mean? So it's just, it's just you, you know, you don't do stuff because you try to get, you know, recognition for it. You do it because it needs to be done. Okay. And, you know, that's just how I was raised, you know what I mean? Okay. I'm going to play my day role. Uh, Mr. Stewart told me to stay <laughs> focused on the uh, event coming up September 11th, 12th, September and 13th, 11th. big time yeah. weekend. Mark, this is the second one? This is the, the second, second annual. Yeah. yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Suggs. The second annual again. This is, again, just like last year, what I love about the event, uh, Terrell introduced a whole new, I guess, party climate in, in, uh, in Baltimore. In addition to being for a good cause, it was like, you know, you were in, what was it last year? Miami? No, Vegas. Vegas. So this year it's 007, so you know what that means. You got to be clean. You know what I'm saying? I'm, com I'm coming down. I'm, I'm coming down and have my James Bond on. So when I put my James Bond on, you don't be scared. Don't be scared now. And ladies, you know I'm married, so don't, it's going to be tempting, but no. Because Allison no. will be showing up with the yes. baseball bat in the night. So T Sizzle, I got the T Sizzle pass for the weekend, so it's going to be all the popping and for a good cause. Okay. Uh, big Brother, I got it, and this is for sickle cell anemia. Yeah. Why'd you choose sickle cell anemia? I mean, it well, is, you know, something that a different. Yeah, African -American. Yeah, it's, it's like, you know, it's primarily found in African Americans, so I wanted to do a charity that, you know, gave back to my community at the same time. Like, you always see, uh, you know, charity events for lupus, leukemia, breast cancer. You hardly ever see any, you know, for sickle cell, if any at all, you know, besides the things that T-Wise be doing. You know, she's coming to the party, by the way. You know, besides what she was doing, you never really see or hear about it, so... I just kind of want to, you know, extend my hand to that, to that call. Okay, I, I got to take you to something very serious. Here in the city of Baltimore, no doubt football is a great way to challenge aggression, but we busting caps in Baltimore. I mean, th is that a topic that ever comes across your desk? I mean, 12, 15 people in, in a matter of hours? Uh, your thoughts? I, I, I was like, I, was, I couldn't believe it. Like, you know what I mean? I, it's just, it just to go to show that times is kind of really hard. And that, you know, an event like this, it will really do our city some good, you know what I mean? Just, let's just get away and let's all just relax and let's just have some fun, you know what I mean? Just, let's just get back to what we do best, you know? Okay. That's, we just hang out with each other and party. So. Okay, I got an off-brand question for you. You went to Arizona State University, yeah, right? Yeah, I did. Yes, I did. What was your favorite subject? Uh, the bed, you know, when the, <laughs> the part where you like party out all night and then go to class the next morning. That was my favorite class all day. Now I'm just playing. Uh, I don't know. Whatever one was the easiest, probably like some plant biology or something. I don't know. I wasn't, I wasn't really one of those book guys. But, but no, the whole college experience was fun and stuff. I, I recommend everybody try to do it. Okay. Any any shot of hope to the young people in Baltimore in particular? Um, shot of hope. Man, that, that's a whole other topic. Like, I go real deep and profound, and now you like on tears on that. But <laughs> I mean, I think uh, definitely I, I, my my challenge would be to the to the big brothers and and, uh, and the fathers of Baltimore. You know, because you know our kids are our future, and uh, we got to get them a chance. You know what I'm saying? So I say let's let's step up to the plate because this is the time right now where they need us the most. So I say to the big brothers and uh, and, and the fathers. And, and, the, and the, you know, and the men of Baltimore, let's, let's step up to the plate and let's take our position because, you know, you only get one chance at this, and let's not rob our children of their future. You know what I mean? Good deal. The website, the website again is? Yeah. TeamSizzleWorldwide.com. Good deal. We did a good job, Mr. Stewart. I just try. Okay. <laughs> Keep doing what you're doing. Corey, we good? We good, Donnie. Good deal. Keep watching BeMoreNews.com, the news before the news, where we uncover the truth.